The clock is ticking on the International Space Station. As 2028 approaches, the year Russia plans to withdraw from the ISS, the space community has been holding its breath. But today, I've got news that changes everything. While concerns have been mounting about maintaining America's continuous presence in space, Axiom Space has just unveiled a game-changing update to their commercial space station plans. They're not just building a replacement for the ISS, they're accelerating their timeline in a way that could transform the future of human spaceflight. Remember that race to establish the next home in low Earth orbit? The one where China's Tiangong space station seemed to be gaining the upper hand? Well, the playing field just shifted dramatically. Axiom Space has completely revamped their construction sequence, and what they're planning to do is unlike anything we've seen before. You see, this isn't just about building another space station. It's about ensuring that when the ISS reaches the end of its journey, humanity's foothold in space doesn't skip a beat. The strategy Axiom has just revealed could make that transition happen two years earlier than anyone expected. I'm your host from Elon Musk 24 Hours, and today we're going to break down exactly how Axiom plans to pull off this ambitious feat, what it means for the future of commercial space stations, and why this could be the key to maintaining American leadership in orbit. Let's dive right in. The story of America's presence in space stands at a critical turning point. For over two decades, the International Space Station has been our home among the stars, a beacon of international cooperation and scientific achievement. But now, as we face the reality of Russia's planned departure in 2028, the urgency to maintain our foothold in orbit has never been more pressing. This isn't just about keeping astronauts in space, it's about preserving decades of progress, protecting billions in investments, and ensuring America doesn't cede its leadership in space to rising powers like China. The stakes couldn't be higher, and until recently, the path forward seemed uncertain. But today, everything changes. Axiom Space has just revealed a revolutionary update to their space station construction plans that could preserve America's continuous presence in orbit. The breakthrough lies not in new technology, but in a brilliantly reimagined construction sequence that could have their station operational a full two years earlier than originally planned. Here's where it gets interesting. Instead of following the traditional approach of building living quarters first, Axiom is flipping the script. They're prioritizing what they call the Payload Power Thermal Module, or PPTM. This isn't just another module, it's the key to independence. By launching this power hub first, Axiom creates something unprecedented, a space station capable of free flight from day one. Think about what this means. The moment this power module docks with the ISS, it becomes a potential lifeboat, a backup plan that could deploy at a moment's notice. It's like building a ship while it's already at sea, but making sure it can sail solo before adding the cabins. The engineering behind this is fascinating. In Turin, Italy right now, Thales Alenia Space is pushing the boundaries of what's possible. They're not starting from scratch. They're adapting the proven design of their habitat modules, saving precious time and resources. The pressure shell is nearly complete, and by fall 2025, it will make its journey to Houston for final integration. But here's where the story takes an unexpected turn. This accelerated timeline isn't just about meeting deadlines. It's about seizing an opportunity. You see, while Russia's planned departure in 2028 might seem like a crisis, Axiom sees it as a catalyst for change. Their new construction sequence transforms a potential gap in American space presence into a seamless transition from government to commercial operations. The numbers tell a compelling story. The PPTM could launch as early as 2027, giving it a crucial year of testing while attached to the ISS. This timing isn't coincidental. It aligns perfectly with Russia's departure, ensuring there's no interruption in American space operations. It's a chess move that positions Axiom not just as a successor to the ISS, but as a pioneer of a new era in commercial space operations. Mark Gittleman, Axiom's chief operating officer, put it best when he described their vision. Our goal is to ensure a smooth transition from a government to a commercial platform maintaining a continuous human presence on orbit to serve a community of global customers and partners, including NASA. These aren't just words, they're a blueprint for the future of space exploration. 
The habitat modules haven't been forgotten in this new plan. HAB-1, with its cutting-edge living quarters designed for four astronauts, has already reached significant milestones. The pressure vessel shell and hatches are complete, setting the stage for a launch shortly after the PPTM. Following that, a dedicated airlock module will expand the station's capabilities, enabling crucial spacewalks and external operations. But this is more than just a construction project. It's a race against time with global implications. While Axiom accelerates its plans, China's Tiangong Space Station continues to grow. The competition isn't just about prestige, it's about securing humanity's future in space. Every delay, every setback could tip the balance of power in orbit. The financial challenges are real. Axiom faces significant costs on multiple fronts, payments to contractors, launch expenses, and maintaining a skilled workforce. Earlier this year, these pressures led to difficult decisions, including layoffs and project adjustments. But rather than scaling back their vision, Axiom has adapted, streamlined, and emerged stronger. What makes this story even more compelling is the role of SpaceX. As the most reliable launch provider in the industry today, SpaceX isn't just a contractor. They're a crucial partner in this endeavor. Their Falcon rockets provide the dependable access to space that Axiom needs while the development of Starship promises even greater capabilities in the future. The partnership goes deeper than launches. SpaceX has already supported three Axiom missions to the ISS, providing invaluable experience in space station operations. These missions aren't just about transportation. They're dress rehearsals for the future, testing procedures, training crews, and building the expertise needed to operate a commercial space station. But Axiom isn't alone in this new space race. Other players like VAST and Sierra Space are pushing forward with their own ambitious plans. VAST's integration of SpaceX's Starlink system and their targeted 2025 launch date make them a serious competitor. Sierra Space's innovative inflatable module design offers unlimited scalability, presenting a different but equally compelling vision of our future in space. This competition, however, isn't just about business. It's about ensuring America's continued leadership in space exploration. Each of these companies brings unique strengths and innovations to the table, pushing the boundaries of what's possible and creating redundancy in our space infrastructure. The path ahead isn't without challenges. Technical hurdles remain to be overcome. Schedules must be coordinated. International partnerships need to be strengthened. But for the first time, we can see a clear path forward a way to maintain our presence in space without interruption. What makes this moment truly historic is its potential impact on human spaceflight. We're not just replacing an aging space station, we're laying the groundwork for a new economy in orbit. Axiom Station will serve not just government agencies, but private companies, researchers, and eventually space tourists. It's a platform for innovation, discovery, and commercial opportunities we can barely imagine today. The significance of this timeline acceleration cannot be overstated. By having their power module ready to operate independently by 2028, Axiom ensures that America's presence in space remains unbroken. This isn't just about maintaining scientific research or international prestige, it's about securing our future among the stars. Every successful space station launch throughout history has taught us something crucial, that humanity's future lies not just on Earth, but in the cosmos, from Skylab to Mir to the ISS, each station has built upon the lessons of its predecessors. Now Axiom is poised to take the next step, carrying forward the best of what we've learned while pioneering new approaches for a commercial future in space. This is the moment where theory becomes reality, where plans become action, and where the future of space exploration takes a decisive turn. Axiom's accelerated timeline isn't just a schedule change. It's a bold statement about America's commitment to leading the next chapter in human spaceflight. As we watch this story unfold, we're not just observers. We're witnesses to a pivotal moment in space history. As Axiom Space races to meet this ambitious 2028 timeline, they're not just building a replacement for the ISS. They're crafting the next chapter in humanity's space story. This accelerated construction sequence, led by the power module launch, represents more than just technical innovation. 
It's a bold statement that America's leadership in space won't skip a beat when the ISS retires. The success of this mission depends on countless factors. The precision of engineers in Turin, the reliability of SpaceX launches, and the dedication of teams working around the clock in Houston. But one thing is certain, we're witnessing a pivotal moment in space exploration history. This is why we need your voice in this conversation. What impact do you think this accelerated timeline will have on America's space leadership? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Will Axiom's strategy of launching the power module first prove to be the game changer we're hoping for? If you want to stay updated on this developing story and other groundbreaking space developments, make sure to subscribe to Elon Musk 24 hours. Hit that notification bell to join our community of space enthusiasts who are watching history unfold. Together, we're tracking humanity's next giant leap into the cosmos. This is Elon Musk 24 hours, where we bring you the future of space exploration today. The dawn of commercial space stations is here, and SpaceX is leading the charge. In just a few months, the legendary Falcon 9 rocket will embark on one of its most ambitious missions yet, launching the world's first commercial space station, Haven 1. This isn't just another satellite deployment or cargo run. This is the moment private enterprise takes its biggest step toward making space accessible to more than just government astronauts. The story begins in the heart of California, where a bold startup called Vast has spent the last four years meticulously crafting something extraordinary. While the aging International Space Station enters its twilight years, Vast and SpaceX have been quietly revolutionizing what a space station can be. They're not just building a replacement, they're reimagining human presence in orbit. Today, we're taking you behind the scenes of this groundbreaking project. You'll discover how a small team of visionaries is transforming space station design from its luxurious interior that rivals high-end hotels to breakthrough technology that could change how we live and work in space. And with the launch window opening in August 2025, we're closer than ever to seeing this dream become reality. Hi everyone, welcome back to Elon Musk 24 Hours. If you're new here and want to stay updated on the biggest developments in commercial space, make sure to hit that subscribe button. We're on our way to 100,000 subscribers and your support means everything to us. Let's dive right in. In the sprawling industrial heart of Long Beach, California, something revolutionary is taking shape. Inside Vast's manufacturing facility, skilled technicians work around the clock, their precision tools crafting the components that will become humanity's first commercial home among the stars. The primary structure of Haven One isn't just another piece of aerospace hardware, it's the foundation of a new era in space exploration. Just last month, on a crisp January morning in Mojave, California, the team achieved a crucial milestone. The qualification unit of Haven 1 arrived at the test site, a full-scale replica that would prove the station's ability to withstand the brutal forces of launch and the harsh reality of space. Each weld, each joint, each connection must be perfect. There's no room for error when you're building humanity's future home in orbit. But Haven 1 is more than just a feat of engineering. This is where vast vision truly shines. Gone are the sterile, utilitarian interiors we've come to expect from space stations. Instead, picture warm maplewood veneer panels lining the walls, creating an atmosphere that feels more like a luxury sky lodge than a scientific outpost. At the heart of the station, a stunning dome window stretches over a meter wide, offering astronauts an unparalleled view of our blue marble below. Drew Fusel, a veteran astronaut who's commanded the ISS, has been instrumental in shaping Haven One's design. Having spent countless nights in space, he understands better than most the challenges of living in zero gravity. Sleep is everything up there, Fusel explains, and while floating weightless feels amazing at first, your body craves that earthly comfort of pressure against your back. That's why Vast developed a revolutionary sleep system, a queen-size bed that uses carefully calibrated pressure to simulate the feeling of gravity, helping astronauts get the rest they need to perform at their best. The station's common area is where science meets luxury. In a space spanning 24 cubic meters, 
about a quarter the size of the ISS's Destiny module, crews will find thoughtful touches that make extended stays not just bearable, but enjoyable. A retractable table transforms from a workstation to a dining area, while the resistance band exercise system ensures astronauts can maintain their strength in microgravity. And thanks to SpaceX's Starlink system, astronauts will stay connected to loved ones back on Earth with high-speed internet access. But make no mistake,